Welcome to Module 5, Lesson 5. You're going to go to page 131. Our I can statement is, I can find a three-digit number and draw or write it in different ways. So we're going to continue our work with our three-digit numbers. Let's look at the first problem on page 131. Number one, look for the blue dot on the number line. Follow the steps. Show the number in different ways. Letter A says, find the blue dot on the number line. There it is. What number should be below the blue dot? Hmm. Here we have 640. Here is 635. How much is each little tick worth? Each of those is worth one. So let's think what is one less than 640? One less than 640 would be 639. Letter B wants us to write the number name. Let's go ahead and write it out. Remember, we're gonna start with the greatest place value. 639. Let's look at letter C. We need to draw a quick picture for our number 639. Before we do, let's label how many hundreds, tens, and ones are in the number. We'll just write it right above. Six hundreds, 39 has three tens and nine ones. Go ahead and draw your picture to show this number. Pause if you need any more time to draw your picture. You should have drawn six hundreds, three tens, and nine ones. Let's look at the second problem. You're going to write the number 912 in different ways. The first thing you're going to do is write it as hundreds, tens, and ones. Well, let's think 912. Well, we can hear those nine hundreds in there. And let's think about the number 12. 12 is made of one ten and two ones. Now we're gonna write it in expanded form. Go ahead and write the value of each of these. The value of nine hundreds is equal to nine hundred. The value of one ten is 10. And the value of two ones is two. So we need to write the number 912. Right, let's look at check understanding. You're going to find the green dot on the number line. Then you'll write the number in different ways. So there's our green dot. Think about what it's after or what it's before to help you figure out what number it is. Then you'll write the number name, the number in expanded form, and the number itself. 
you might want to start with number three to help you. and pause the video if you need any more time. I'm gonna actually start this check understanding with number three. I can see that the green dot is one after 455. That tells me this number is 456. I'm gonna work backwards and write an expanded form. I have a digit four in the hundreds place. I know the value of that digit is 400. My digit five in the tens place has the value of 50. And my digit one in the six, digit six in the ones place has the value of six. Now again, I'll start with the greatest place value to write the number name. 400. 